Our videos are made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags, available at Amazon right now. Hello everyone and thanks for joining us. I'm Ranger Rob and welcome to Ranger Rob Country Living. And today's day one, starting our greenhouse build. So we're doing this one in uh, uh, front back panels. Uh, so we'll build panels literally in front of the yard up here. For example, this will be the back. So uh, basically we're going to keep making these modules and take them to the back and then uh, slowly start erecting them. Uh, so let's be our back. This will actually have a window in it. Um, and our other front panel, which we can't build till next week because, sorry about the wind, uh, we're putting a screen door that we ordered in it. So uh, we can't actually build it, but we can do the back and the sides and uh, uh, get them upright and put some temporary boards in to hold them in place in case it gets windy. Uh, so anyway, it's kind of exciting. We're going to get the first day going here, find out what mistakes we've made in our drawings, and uh, we're going to get going. So here we go. Well, the cool thing about doing this setup here is we're building everything here and we got our, our boards measured. We do have to trim off a half inch on these 14 footers, but the cool part is we could use the new miter saw, which is mobile. So uh, the only bad thing is, is we don't want to get it dirty. That'd be kind of a bummer. It's all shiny. I have no problem getting that dirty. <laughs> Okay, we're ready to get it dirty. Let's go. So we're coming along pretty good. We got the back panel and we're 21 feet across so we're doing a 5 and 2 8 uh, panel. So we got four of these panels to build. So we're, we're on the second one now. We've almost got all these panels done today. And, uh, oh, are you eating my milkshake? You're busted. What are we doing here? Hey, where'd my straw go? It appears that my milkshake has been gotten to. Get out of my milkshake! This is why you don't want to do constructions with a dog. Well guys, it's getting a little cool out here. We don't know if we're going to get any rain or mixed snow or not. But it's definitely brisk out here. We got, uh, we're on our fourth panel now. And uh, we're kind of contemplating going ahead and making the 14th footer for the front. But not putting the uh, uh, two by fours in the center until we get our door. But uh, we'll have to see how well we hold up. But we're getting ready to put this fourth panel together and then we'll make that decision. Well, we got brave. We decided we're going to go ahead and do the other and without the centerpieces in. So uh, these are 14 foot uh, length and uh, we had to shave off an inch, which we already did on the miter. And uh, 
Sherry's just getting it all set up for putting in our uh, studs and uh, we'll get it together and we'll have all the panels pretty much built. Well, we got all the panels done. The center section here, we can't put the wood in yet until we get our door. We're gonna get the measurements right. All the other panels, the back, the front, the sides, and uh, this fourth set of the, those, two sets of those, will be 14 by 21. And then we'll be putting cattle panels across on the top once we get this uh, laid out on the ground, get it leveled, and cinch it to the ground with uh, rebarb. And uh, yeah, so uh, that's all we have for today, guys. We're spent. I gotta cook dinner tonight. Salmon and a variety of uh, zucchinis. And what? By the way, when you do that, you gotta put bacon bits in it. And of course, I was not kidding about salmon in the trigger tonight. So uh, basically. What I do is uh, take a couple of uh, piece steaks of salmon, a uh, little salt and pepper, garlic. Uh, I put Japanese mayo on it, or mayonnaise. You don't have to use Japanese. Then I use uh, the filtered butter, and uh, which looks terrible at first, uh, but it's not real fatty stuff. And uh, of course, I sprinkle a little dill, and uh, it did say garlic too, right? I hope. Anyway. Uh, just firing up the grill. Going to take it up to about 350. Uh, always cook your salmon up to 145 or better. And enjoy, guys. And we're also doing mixed zucchini with bacon bits in it. I'm doing that in the oven. And uh, rice aroni. Why not? Anyway, guys, have a great day. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. We appreciate it. Have a great day, guys. Bye now. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.